Welcome back, dear viewers. As we all probably know, there are 247 countries in the world. Out of these, 197 are recognised by the United Nations. While most of the others are micronations or independent provinces, a few countries exist that are only inhabited by a few families. Surprising, right? Over the years, each of us has heard of the, most of the countries recognised by the United Nations, but there are territories that exist on our planet Earth that we never knew existed. These masses of land occupy a very small area. From quaint islands to the little land parcels tucked safely away, let's look at some of the smallest countries to exist with a population less than that of a village. Before you dive into the video, don't forget to share, subscribe, like and turn on the bell for more interesting videos. 10. Palau Doesn't the name sound familiar? The island of Palau was mentioned in the movie Journey to the Mysterious Island, but let me tell you, the movie does no justice to this beautiful island. The Republic of Palau is an island country, located in the continent of Oceania. For those of you who don't know, the continent of Oceania consists of the islands located in the oceans which do not come under the other continents. Palau is an archipelago located in the Pacific Ocean. It consists of more than 300 coral and volcanic islands on the Kyushu Palau Ridge. It spans an area of 459 square kilometers and has a population of 21,347 people. The ethnicity in Palau is diverse, as people from all over the world occupy this island. Most of the economy in Palau comes from the government, naturally, right? Palau is known for its rainforest, which consists of unique wildlife, birds, and 130 different species of threatened shark. The climate in Palau is tropical. Aside from all this, let me tell you about the specialty of this island. The most remarkable sight in this country is the lake with over 2 million jellyfish in it. I definitely want to visit this country. Do you? 9. New New is another island that exists in the continent of Oceania. What's special regarding this island, you ask? It's the island where nature hasn't been touched yet. It is a Pacific island paradise. It may come on the list of the smallest countries, but it is the largest raised coral atoll on Earth. It is the smallest and the largest at the same time. The capital city spans an area of just 261.46 square kilometers. Can you guess the population of this island? There are just a mere 100,090 people. This island surprisingly has its own airport and single supermarket. The climate of this island country resembles that of New Zealand and is tropical. Despite the amazing views, tourism is not popular. This is probably why nature is still preserved. If you do visit this country, there is always plenty to do and see here. You can explore limestone caves, snorkel in warm water, swim with dolphins, go on hikes, and much more. 8. Principality of Saborga This is a country within a state located in the northwestern Italian province of Imperia in Liguria, near the French border. Want to know what's different about this place? It is a monarchy and is ruled by his tremendousness Marcello, the first, to be followed by Princess Nina. This tiny country even consists of an army. The army includes just three people, a defence minister and two border guards. It claims an area of 14 square kilometres and has a population of 312 people. The village of Saborga looks like it has been lifted straight from the pages of a fairy tale. It fits the picture postcard stereotype of rural Italy with its mountaintop location medieval streets, and the traditional Catholic Church. 7. Sovereign Military Order of Malta Ever wondered if a building can be a separate state? Well, yes it can. At least, the Sovereign Military Order of Malta is. It is a tiny country on the territory of Rome. It has an area of 0.0012 square kilometres and occupies only three buildings. Three buildings next to each other don't sound so small, right? But two of its buildings are in Rome and one is located on the island of Malta. It was established in the 11th century in Jerusalem. The Sovereign Order of Malta is one of the most ancient establishments of Western and Christian civilization. It is a religious Catholic order and an independent subject of international law. You all must be wondering what would the population of a country made up of three buildings be? Well, it is not as small as you would expect. The population of this country is 113,500 people. Six. The Principality of Sealand. Speaking of small countries, ever wondered what the smallest country to ever exist is? The Principality of Sealand is a micronation in the North Sea, but is not an island. 
It is located six miles away from the coast of Great Britain. Sealand is governed by self-proclaimed Prince Regent. It merely covers an area of 0.004 square kilometers and has a population of just 27 people and is governed by Prince Michael Bates. The other reason this country is known is that anyone can become a count, baron or a duke of this country. All somebody has to go and do is go on their website and buy a noble title for a few hundred British pounds. 5. Nauru Wondering where you've heard the name of this country? This small island country, Nauru, holds the record for the highest number of obese people. Wait a minute, if it holds a record, how many obese people are there? The obesity rate in this country is more than 70%. Nauru, formerly called Pleasant Island, is an island country and microstate in Oceania. This island has a dark history and used to be Australia's dumping ground for refugees. Wondering what its source of economy is? Nauru is a phosphate rock island known for the quality of its rich deposits near the surface, making strip mining easier. Phosphate was Nauru's main resource and sole export dominating the economy until the island ran out of phosphate deposits. Climate is hot and humid year round. It spans an area of 21 square kilometers and has a population of 9,591 people. 4. Tuvalu Ever wondered which is the least visited country in the world? It is the closest thing to paradise. Tourists who go there find a thriving Polynesian culture and coral reefs for snorkeling. The economic situation of the tiny country is disastrous. Till a few years back, Tuvalu hadn't been given the internet domain. As it is low-lying, it falls prey to rising sea levels. Its revenue mainly comes from the sale of fishing licenses. Wondering why the name Tuvalu sounds so familiar? If you watched FIFA in 2010, then you would know this country as it sent its own soccer team. The nation, comprising of nine isles, formerly known as Elise Islands, spans an area of 26 square kilometers and has a population of 10,959 people and is known for its seafaring skills and it trains more than 120 marine cadets a year. 3. The Republic of Molossia Ever wondered if you can have your own country? Well, Kevin Ball brought his idea to life when he declared Molossia as a micronation. This small country even has its own claim to fame. It was said to be at war with East Germany. This tiny country has its own space program, navy and naval academy, and its own time zone. As of 2017, the Republic turned 40. It is located in Nevada and covers an area of 0.05 square kilometers. When it was declared its own country, it had a population of seven. As of today, its population has increased to 34, which includes dogs. Two. Liechtenstein. Has it ever crossed your mind that it would be nice to live in the richest country in the world? Let me tell you about the richest country in the world. Liechtenstein looks and sounds as if it has been lifted out of a fairy tale and is the only nation located completely in the Alps. It is double landlocked between the coast of Switzerland and Austria. It is a constitutional monarchy led by Prince Hans Adams II. The power is shared between the prince and the people. It was established within the Holy Roman Empire in 1719, and in 1806, it became a sovereign state. The economy is mainly based on industry, manufacturing, and service sectors. In 2013, Liechtenstein won a super solar super state prize for the usage of maximum photovoltaics per population within the state. The climate in Liechtenstein is continental with cold and cloudy winters. It covers an area of 62 square miles and has a population of roughly 38,000 people. It is a German-speaking microstate, and you can join the royal family for a beer in the gardens of picturesque Valdus Castle. 1. The Principality of Hutt River It is a micronation located in the province of Australia. The founder of this country was Leonard Castley, when he declared his farm to be a new and independent state. It has its own currency, passports and stamps. Tourism is one of the main sources of economy for this country. Wondering what tourist sites are present in this tiny area? The prime attractions include a non-denominational chapel and Princess Shirley's sacred educational shrine and busts of Prince Leonard I. This country spans an area of 75 square kilometers and has a population of a mere 30 people. So that's all for now. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video and want to visit places and travel more often. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and hit the bell for more such entertaining videos.